Good morning. It is the first week of April, and that means two things. One, it is now definitely spring, and two, that means it is the start of wildflower season. I am here in the Yakima Canyon, and I am going to be hiking a trail I have done before, but I wanted to come back to in spring, and that would be Umtanum Ridge Crest, which climbs 2,000 feet for about six miles round trip. And since it is spring here, it means the early wildflower bloom has started. So I am going to be climbing up to the top to get some amazing views and also looking for wildflowers along the way. Ever since I did this trail, I always knew I wanted to come back in spring because it's supposed to be gorgeous. It is obviously a beautiful day, chilly to start out, but I'm gonna warm up pretty quickly climbing. Let's go find some wildflowers. Oh my gosh, that is probably the best wildlife sighting I've had so far this year. Um, it is still very early morning and I think I am the first person on this trail so none of the wildlife has been spooked away. They were just right there but um, as you can see it warmed up. I'm in the sun so I get to enjoy the increasing views and oh wow see more wildflowers and hopefully see some more animals oh my gosh look wait right there they are they're playing oh ah there they go hop hop i think it's it looks like it's three adults and one juvenile, one is smaller, and they seem to be looking after it, so. <sighs> ah, that is awesome. That alone was worth the drive. Ah, oh, you can see the view just got better. I'm in the sun, it's warm now, it was cold in the shade in the canyon, but now I get to enjoy nice sun exposed climb and warm up Well, as I'm sure you can see, I have gained quite a bit of elevation. I am basically on top of the ridge, I climbed out of the valley, and now I have these amazing views. And also, you probably saw in the footage, I got to an elevation where more of the wildflowers are blooming. Ah, but most importantly, I can see my destination. So, you can tease up this. That right there is the top, and if I recall, 
the final half mile up this thing is steep. And there's another reason I did this. It's a very good training hike. It's got a lot of good steep inclines and I'm training for some bigger stuff later this month. So this is a really good one. But look at that. Gorgeous. It's even better with the wildflowers, but uh, I'll get up there. I think I can do it in half an hour. We'll see. I give you the top of Umtanum Ridge and the, oh wow, wait till you see the view. I, the last time I did this, it was cloudy. I had no idea the view I was missing because look, Rainier, Mount Adams, and this is not gonna show up on camera, but, Way in the distance south, I can see Mount Hood down in Oregon. Three volcanoes! I had no idea you could see Mount Hood from here on a clear day. Oh, that is crazy! Wow, the, yeah, this is... This just exceeded my expectations even more. I knew I was going to get a view of uh, Rainier at the very least. Adams looks so close too. And then, of course, we have the Cascades and this is the Enchantment Range. The big white pointy one in the middle, that is Mount Stewart. Beautiful. But oh my gosh, this view. I guess I'm kind of giving the tour. So we got the Enchantments. This is Yakima Canyon, the Yakima Hills. Gorgeous. Here's a little benchmark up here for the top of the ridge. And then we've got south going into Yakima. Mount Hood down there, Mount Adams, Mount Rainier. Uh, these rolling hills, these views of the snow capped volcanoes. Huh. Wow. So cool. Well, I'm going to enjoy up here for a little bit, explore, do some volcano photography, <laughs> have my snack because, whoo, the, uh, the final push up this is as steep as I remember. It is steep, which is good because that's what I wanted, but whew, man, this view. I am heading back down and I'll show you how steep this final section is because I'm pretty sure it's like a 40 to 45 percent grade at one stretch so it is steep but oh this descent is going to be gorgeous because look at this is going to be my view so I just weave down along here dip down into the canyon you can see the river at the bottom but I'm not sure if it's coming out on camera, but the hills definitely have a yellow tint to them. <clears throat> and that is because I think what is blooming right now is all of these um, wild buttercups. Um, I'll have to try and identify them, but they are, I mean, I got some shots of them and I'll get some more 
they're just kind of painting sections of these hills yellow. It is so pretty. So get to enjoy some wildflower gold and oh, this view of these rolling hills. Gorgeous and a nice breeze. <laughs> but yeah, um, you can see, you can't even see how steep this is. We're gonna drop down there. Whew. After that, it'll be smooth sailing and maybe I will run into those deer again. That'd be cool. There is a pygmy horned lizard right on the trail. I'm gonna try and not spook him. He was just skittering down. I saw him. Let's see if we can get a look at him. Look at him! He's like probably, I wanna say like three inches long. He's got these short body, long tail. These are not dangerous. We've seen them one time here before. It's probably out sunbathing. So cute! He's got a whole old wildflower field to live in. Well, that was a beautiful continuation of early spring hiking. Last week I was in the North Cascades, this week I'm in Yakima Canyon, and I am so glad I came back in spring for this trail. The wildflowers were starting to bloom, and I think that the yellow ones, um, there were some balsam root, but I think the yellow ones were some kind of daisy, that's what they looked like, and there were wild pansies and some bluebells, and it's just so pretty. Like, I could see yellow covering that midsection of the hills, and of course, like, the wildlife, like, this really felt like spring, you know, the flowers are blooming, all the animals are coming back out, and wow, yeah, I'm so happy I came back to this because the view at the top is so much better on a clear day. I knew I'd be able to see Rainier, and I did know I'd be able to see Adams, but Mount Adams looks so much closer than I was expecting, and I was not expecting to be able to see Mount Hood, so that is a surprisingly good view, and highly recommend. Um, but yeah, this is, make no mistake, this is a steep climb, or at least the last, I want to say quarter mile, it gets very steep. It just goes straight up. Um, there are no switchbacks and stuff to help you up that steep incline. You just go straight up, uh, which is one of the reasons I wanted to do it because, um, it's a really good training hike. So highly recommend this area is beautiful. And I think that was another perfect spring day. Ah, I get to enjoy a beautiful drive out of Yakima Canyon and over some Qualmy Pass. Thank you so much for watching. And here are some, some of my favorite pictures from the trail today. Enjoy. Enjoy.